Want to learn a little bit more about the Chevening Scholarship? Then stay tuned. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel for another video. It's not a tutorial this time, but um, more so of an information video. If you saw in my post earlier this week, then you would see that I've been awarded the 2020 Chevening Scholarship in Jamaica. So I actually wanted to post a few videos in relation to that scholarship. So if you want to learn a little bit more, then let's just get into it. All right, so for those who don't know, uh, the Chevening Scholarship is a scholarship for most persons who desire to pursue a master's degree. And not just a master's degree really, but a master's degree in the United Kingdom. So it's a fully funded scholarship that is meant to allow, um, to allow you the opportunity to undertake this program for one year. So like it's the full works, it's all paid for, school fees paid for, you get a stipend per month, um, you get different allowances. Yeah, it's a full nine yards. It's amazing. Uh, if you want to learn more about the Achievement Scholarship, you probably already know. If you're watching this video, then I'm guessing you already know about the Achievement Scholarship. But if not, then I'll put the link down below so that you can learn a little bit more about it. So my first couple videos um, is really meant to help those persons who are interested in applying right now. Um, of course, you would know that from your own research, you know that there are a few requirements that you need. Um, for instance, you you have to be working for a certain number of years already, whether it's full time or part time, two years. Um, you would have to have a, an undergraduate degree that would allow you to be able to get into the, a master's program. So it doesn't matter the class really, as long as you can get into a master's program with that degree. Right, and uh, more importantly, the the achieving scholarship is a leadership scholarship. So it's not academically based necessarily. Um, that's important as well. But what's more important is that you are able to display your own leadership ability. Uh, you would need to be able to really show that you are a leader in your field. Um, and that you also have a clear vision of what you want to do for your country, really. So over the next couple of videos, I want to I want to give some kind of tips as to how to go about your essays because there are four essays that you need to write. Uh, I want to be able to give you some real life examples of that by reading my own examples or my own essay. So guys, I will see you in the next video where I am talking about my own essays and giving you my own tips. Alright, so thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time.